Dear December, I never considered you a month of change. You are always rock solid, the same. But I look forward to December this year and try to think back to the last ones and so many things are different. Sure, I've still got my birthday and family birthdays and Christmas and New Year's and I still have no time to breathe, but things feel different. Maybe it's just me growing up, but I feel calmer. I've seen 23 of you, so what's a 24th? And I feel more in control of my life than before. I'm as healthy as I can ask for, and while the grief still hits, it's manageable. You, December, are going to make my back hurt so much I won't want to move, but I know that already. I know that Christmas will hurt. But I also know I'll manage. Will manage. And I don't know if there are any surprises in store, but I think I'm prepared for you, December. Dear December, you exhausted me. Like every year, so much happened that it was hard to keep track. But while I usually swim through it, I wasn't sure if I was drowning or floating this time. I thought I was prepared. I thought I was ready to be 24 years old and have a Christmas with gifts again and be a year distant from the hell that was 2017. I wasn't. You pulled me in like a riptide. I couldn't control or escape, but I don't think I wanted to. I love you, dear December. You give me so many gifts, my family, my friends, twofold proof that I have survived yet another revolution around the sun. I smile the most because of you and all the joy you bring, but now your wintry atmosphere makes my body ache. The twinkling lights weren't quite enough to ward off the darkness, and the specific loneliness of missing certain people, even when you're surrounded by loved ones, cut hard. So December, you gave me an equal amount of joy and sadness and contentness and stress. But that's also on me. I chose to start a new job and make projects for myself and go out every single weekend because I missed my friends and family. I changed. But December, if the lack of snowy days proves anything, it's that you change too, and I have to learn to love you just the same. Thank you, December, for everything. I'll see you again soon. Special thanks to Jay Patel for being my patron. If you would like to support my video work, head on over to my Patreon and check out the perks.